got some leaks, some spoilers, all types of stuff to get through today. We got Titan and Shimu apparently been leaked. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you, I wasn't even supposed to record today. I mean, look at my hair. I look like I've been attacked by Shimu. But in the video we're gonna be seeing today, we're gonna see what he's gonna look like as an action figure. How did they release this already? I saw a picture on Twitter, and then I come to YouTube and see a video by Dangerville. Up, so I'm everyone? assuming that's what it's gonna be by. Or that's what it's gonna be about. Well, you know what I'm saying. That's what it was right there. Merchandise for the new empire and certain Giant Kong America. with the beast the arm. I forgot what the beast stands for. Focusing on brand it's new the, Godzilla I forgot what the acronym figures. is. Jada Toys released a commercial for their walking Godzilla figure that even has its own atomic breath. And well, that commercial really reminded me of something you'd see from the That's kind of sick, by the way. Shout out to them. Ultimate Godzilla. I just feel like you don't really see toy commercials anymore. Yeah, I, I, I like that. Nice. I didn't see the commercial. Yeah, I saw a picture. For one of the I didn't even know there was commercials. Toys I've seen since my 90s child. What is days. that? <laughs> Not the Furby, bro. Anybody have a Furby out there? If you do, Godzilla hit that like button. If you don't, now this thing gets you hit that like Godzilla's button. I appreciate you. Less. You get the Godzilla that we've got in the previous films, but if you the Titan Shimo skin, action right figure, here, no, it turns into this evolved guy. Kind of blew my mind. In the new movie. The, the one that I saw on Twitter. I think this thing's going to give more than the children some nightmares. No, that's a fact. Now, it's kind of creepy, but it is what it is. Playmates drop spoils the movie's hidden Titan. It Shiro. does. So let me go ahead and pause right here. I don't know if he's going to mention it, but these are definitely going to be some spoilers. If you're wanting to go into the movie without knowing what Shimo looks like at all, you might want to skip ahead a little bit or just, you know, watch the video. It's going to be OK. We're going in. But fair warning, fair warning. There's a good fraction of people out there it's just going to show you what Shimo is going to look like. To them. It doesn't so really spoil anything. Blind, I respect that. And there you go. Chance to leave the video. I don't so think hard. it's not really spoiling you know, anything. It's just showing you, you know, Titan, then give this what Shimo looks like. We already changed. know he was in the movie. Welcome to Dangerville. We knew he was in the movie after what we explained. Movies.com for getting this content available for everyone, by the way. Shout out, shout out. So remember my the Beast Glove. New weapon, the Beast Glove. What did that I stand asked for? you guys in that video what you thought the acronym stood for, and well, let's see if you got close, because we have the official reveal for it. I think sick. Bio-enhanced anatomic seismic thunder glove. I'm not going to remember that. Bio-enhanced animatronic animatronic anima... You know what? Nah. We're just going to have to wait and see how that technology works in the MonsterVerse before we get more in-depth on that. The action the figures look cool. That we're oh, not that, that thing. King Kong <laughs> thunder fist punch with that last part of the, the name. The thunder punch? Seismic thunder. It just kind of makes sense. True. Right? It would make He's sense. Got a bio for this beast glove now. A prototype battle gauntlet that enhances his earth shattering primal strength. Ooh. Kong roars into battle, packing a meteor impact with every punch. A meteor it's impact. Say Kong's going to have quite the haymaker. In He's going to have the haymaker. The figures. We get a name for the Scar King's bone whip. It's oh, what? It's called the whip slash. Whip so slash. A whip, Ugh. A slash. That's kind of sick. All what right, is that everyone. face? So now it's time for the very odd reveal of the new empire. Here we go. Hidden threat Shimo. Once again, I don't know how they were able to just come out with these, but there we go. To be we haven't seen him in trailers. Adds up to what Nothing. Seen in the Call of Duty Easter Somewhat. Got way back when, fighting Godzilla in the hidden and here he is as an action figure. To see this image in he looks ginormous, by the way. Shimo is huge. If it's like a scale if comparison. Have any sense of scale, which they typically yeah, exactly. Sold in the same packaging. Our new threat is appearing to be. Oh, you can kind of see like the Godzilla picture of him next to the Kong just on the box. The difference in their forelimbs. No wonder Godzilla's body needed to evolve in order to compete with Shimo's monster. Wait a minute! Physically, Godzilla and Shimo are... I mean, the action monster. figure, ah, whatever. It doesn't look that great. But the picture, vibe going next on. to his so name, the next to Kong? Dorsal spines that run down their back. But that Godzilla looks really good. Look at him. Legs, and it's clear Shimo will be on all fours. <gasps> oh, he looks like a more savage. More physically powerful than the G-Man, and definitely faster. No, nah, I'm excited. Big. And while the two do look like they could have... You knew I was excited already, but... tree in this fictional world, it's obvious they have many differences. Like their contrasting color schemes. Let me know if you're excited in the comments, bro. We finally know that Shimo's in the movie. For a fact. The render art displayed on the box shows a creature that looks drastically different than the two. If that's what he looks like, dude. Actually, I know an animation that kind of looks like that Shimo. We're gonna watch that after this, because I think we've seen it a little. some places. And for some We're going to watch it again. It's only like two minutes. I don't know. It looks like he's a kid. Check that's with me. Too much candy or ice cream. That's ice, brother. What are you talking about? It's the ice thing. Me a couple things. 
Either the box's artist got way too crazy with the art, and no one was really on top of making sure that the toys' boxes resembled what we see in the movie. Nah, dude, stuff. that's what it's yeah, probably gonna look like in the movie. Giant companies, they kind of suck at communicating. That is sick. Or that Shimo is going to be able to change his colorations depending on external factors. That could happen too. You know, like if he's fighting in a room with big pink crystals, perhaps his skin is gonna reflect the coloration. So he blends in with I'm so excited to see this its colors like an kaiju in order to better I'm excited in. still considering the backlash legendary got for pink Zilla you do gotta hope that Shimo is more of that did they get backlash though I thought it was like and less of that powder puff for the most part positive thing, whatever everybody always has something there. negative to say so I, like the quadruped I personally like it has. And for the monster verse, bro, I love the way that looks it's going to be like nothing we've seen before it looks so mean the monsters stare each other down. But I want to know what you guys think. For the most, let part, me know what you think about that design in the comments. Enjoy this new monster's design. I don't know about the action the figure, but going towards the picture right there looks look the arc, great. Which, after what we saw with Godzilla, that's kind of to be expected. I like it. The Shimo, though, this Titan's going to have an insanely powerful attack. The so ice breath. Godzilla's atomic blast. What does it say? Frost. Frostbite breath. And I'm going to talk about this new frostbite attack in one of okay. the videos coming out on the channel. Heat ray. So if you're excited for some potential lore confirmation. Bro, I'm so excited. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet, bro. We're gonna be covering all this. Every video I see, we're covering on Shimo. What you think about Shimo's Up until the movie, of course. Once again, I find Shout out to Dangerville. Thank you for bringing this to releasing these toys out into the wild before even revealing Shimo officially. That's what I was saying. Begging for people to talk about the design <laughs> before they actually reveal it. But it does seem at this point. Like I like it. We know he's in the movie. Are wanting the fans to do a lot of the marketing work for the upcoming movie. We're totally yeah, doing the, the marketing work. But you know what? The public I'm for it, bro. I'm excited for this movie. And well, it's a good chance that our new Titan is about to get officially revealed very soon. So apparently he's going to be revealed soon. Let me show you that Shimu I was talking about. Okay, this is the video I was just referring to about that Shimu that kind of looked pretty similar to what was on that box. Now, I think we see him for like a few seconds in this and then it ends. But more or less, you'll see what happens. We got Scar King here battling against Godzilla and Kong. Like I said, this video is only like two minutes, so stick with me. But he really does look, as soon as I saw that on the box, I thought of this video. This is my tick of one. I don't know if I said that. Shout out to him, by the way. But I feel like he kind of got the design down pat. Meanwhile, Scar King getting bodied. I think this is where he comes in, right? He comes out of the ground. Hey, actually, why does Tick of One kind of know what's going on? Remember when Kong was coming out of the ground in the trailer? This was like six months ago. So he couldn't have known anything that was going on. The trailer wasn't even close to being released. Look, that's literally what happened, though. He came out of the ground. And we saw, like, the ice crystals falling in. Tick of one. You got some inside info for us, brother? What's going on here? That's not the image I'm referring to. Wait for it. You'll see. Look at the ice. The frostbite breath. The frostbite breath. That's apparently what they're calling it. You can see all the colors. Just like we saw on the box. You got Scar King with the whip. And let's see him. He's got that grayish tone. And look at him. All the colors on the back, the blue mouth. <laughs> Why does this kind of look like? I mean, as far as like a 2D animation goes, you know. Continue. All right, that's the end of this video. Let me know in the comments or oh, what you think here. I think he, he got some inside him, though. No, but for real, I'm excited to see Shimo in an actual trailer. Thank you for watching with me. I'll see you tomorrow. I love ya. Goodbye.